like, I don't know, night and day. If my sister Judy told Tay to do something, and Tay was stubborn about doing it, Judy fixed a way to make her do it. Because she wouldn't give in, and Tay wouldn't give in. But when they did give in, they was the best of friends. She traveled with Judy. She traveled with my sister Mary. She just loved her family. She loved to go wherever you go. She would go. And I was blessed that God gave me one little angel. She was my little angel. I have lost now three angels. My mom, my sister, and their tag. I was recently had surgery and I was saying, my friend Susie took me to the hospital and I was saying, why, why was they giving me no can? bring me back from the surgery. I was like, I thought I woke up. She said, no, you couldn't wake up. They, they had to hit you with no can. Unfortunately, I guess God wasn't ready for me. I had to be here to get my daughter through this. But I know it's crazy to say, but I think in my heart, I could have dealt with going and let Tay say, I'm older, I've been through things that I don't want anyone else to go through, but if God would have took me and let Tay stay here a little while longer with her mom, but just gave us a little more time to just to love her more. But I guess now, She's looking down at us saying, now we can bring each other up when we're down. Sometimes I'm so depressed or so sad. <coughs> I always know I got a sister I can reach out to. And that's a good thing. Or I'll call it where DD or call it where Susie or call it talk to my sister law that I got down that I love with all my heart. She'll come on the phone and say, you need me to come and help you or do something. It's just a good thing if you have love in your heart. Please give it to people Amen. while they're on earth. Amen. Please don't wait until times like this because if you do, they don't know. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know me and my daughter, we had the roughest times. We would do so much fighting back and forth, it was crazy. But now we're like twins. If me could need something, if I had to walk to New York, I probably would lose a lot of weight, and I would. <laughs> but I got the best brother in the world, because whenever I say I need something, he's like Superman. He's there. <coughs> his wife don't complain. She just let him go do his thing. When he heard that she had passed, he was on it. He was getting plaques. He was fixing music. He was doing and I always was in the time of his birthday, but he didn't say, you know what, I'm selfish. I ain't gonna let him take my birthday. He was like, forget it. I was gonna take care of this baby first. He put her first over him. I just thank God I love my family. I don't show it all the time, but now y'all gonna get sick of me because I'm gonna show my love. I love my brother, I love my sister-in-law. I love my family, and I thank God. I love you, Robert. Love you Everybody too. that has issues with people, please get it right. Because I don't want to have to be at somebody else's service or memorial because you're too stubborn to just say what's in your heart. Whatever's in your heart. If it's, you got an issue with your family member, just tell them. All you can do is make them mad, and they'll get over it sooner or later. But if they don't, then you did your part. You said, I, I made it right. So now, 
I just want my family to know from my heart, I thank all of you for coming together, being a part of what Tay has always had in her life, family and friends. And so now she still got family and friends to give her her going away. Amen. And I thank y'all for the celebration of life, baby.